Lemon trees and oranges grace yards across the Los Angeles suburbs, providing shade, fruit, and a reminder of California's agricultural bounty. But a tiny insect called the Asian citrus psyllid could doom these citrus trees. This crew of state agricultural workers is trying to contain the pest and stop the deadly disease that it carries. At first it's hard to get used to looking for them, but once you see them, you, you get the eye for it. But what we focus on when we come to a tree is we look for new flush on the tree. This invasive species carries an exotic sounding bacteria called Huang Long Bing or HLB. The bacteria causes citrus greening disease, which is fatal to trees. If it were to spread from residential neighborhoods like this one to commercial orchards, it would destroy California's citrus industry. Late last month, a psyllid from this lemon tested positive for HLB. The tree was removed and now the area is under quarantine. No one's allowed to move cuttings or nursery plants out of a 93 square mile area. And fruit at farmers markets must remain covered. Meanwhile, crews are scouring the neighborhood where HLB was found, hunting bugs and looking for infected trees. So we've been doing door-to-door -door survey within that 800-meter boundary. On the ground, their tools are pretty basic. Oh, that one jumped away. But the samples go to a high-tech lab where they'll be tested for the microscopic bacteria. They tend to hop away when you get close to them, so we catch them with an aspirator which sucks them into a vial. Um, then from there, we transfer the psyllids into another vial of alcohol to kill them, um, but yet preserve them so that we, the labs can conduct their DNA analysis. Later, crews will spray pesticides on suspect trees. At stake is a $2 billion industry. Citrus greening disease could devastate the citrus industry in the state of California. Um, many don't realize that California produces over 70% of the fresh citrus fruit that's consumed in the nation. The Asian citrus psyllid spread throughout Florida in a matter of months. Growers, gardeners, and ag officials are hoping that cooperation from the public and a quick response will hold off the disease a little longer here. Raquel Maria Dillon, The Associated Press, Hacienda Heights, California.